for the opposition. Are you on the back foot on Chopper Gate, on Arms Gate, this whole issue? Because, uh, you know, Mr. Jaitley... Uh, on the back foot? Yes. We should be on the offensive. The guys who make the money should be on the back foot. There is the NDA connection. Allow me to elaborate. This London-based consultant, Christian Michael's name was cropped up in this Augusta Westland deal. He had an agreement with Dassault for another defense deal that was sealed in November 2000. That was when you were in power. He did not get his commission. But the broader issue is the impunity with which agents operated. They operated during the NDA time as well. Well, agents will operate. You will have corrupt people and middlemen operating all over the world. How are they allowed if to? You can, if you can identify any political entity during the NDA government who has been responsible for receiving even a rupee in any of these transactions, please hang them. They have not even been able to come out with a shred of evidence they've been in power for nine years. Therefore, at the end of the day, as far as the chopper deal is concerned, as I see it, it's very simple. There is bribe which has been given in negotiating the deal. The bribe giver has been arrested in Italy. The quantum of bribe is known. Bribe is not given to middlemen or agents. They get a commission. Bribe is given to the person who eventually is instrumental in swinging the order. That must be a person in authority. So Whether he is in politics or in the civil service or in the armed forces, that is the gentleman who has to be identified. Sure. That identification has to take place at the Indian end. Yes. So the bribe giver is known, the quantum is known. It is the responsibility of the present government to immediately identify the bribe taker.